another day. I still have the same pimple that I had in the last video. So sorry about that. Nothing I could do about that. Anyways, on a different note, title of this video is what I eat in a day. So I'm going to be taking you guys through very simply the food that I eat throughout the day. This is not to influence you guys to eat like me or to show you that this is the proper way of eating. Everybody eats differently. Are you high? Whatever works for you, works for you. In the morning, I have a very small appetite. I've always been this way. I've never been able to eat a lot, especially when it's super early. Um, right now, it's not that early. I woke up actually really late. Still, with it being my first meal of the day, I'm not that hungry. What I like to do is eat a little pack of Quaker Oats. I know, not the most splendid breakfast. Just boil some water, pour it into a little bowl, mix that up. Today, I'm gonna have a little bit of fruits on the side. I can only eat super light foods in the morning. And then, you cannot stop me from having a coffee every single day. I literally will not be able to just survive that one. So I'm making myself a little iced coffee today. I'm just gonna put that in a cup, add some ice and some creamer, and we're good to go. Breakfast is served. Mmm. I actually really like oatmeal. It doesn't ever look appetizing, but to me, Pretty good. Now it's time to taste my coffee. It's really always a hit or miss for me with my coffee. I do it the same every single day and it'll either come out super watery or just right, so. Mmm. It's actually pretty good. I was gonna go to Starbucks today and bring you guys to get my coffee order in the morning. I'm trying to be conscious of my money ever since I got my hair done. If you guys haven't seen my last video, I spent so much money. And for me, whenever I make a big purchase, I'll literally like cease to spend money because I, I'm like, shit, why did I do that? So with that being said, I'll tell you guys what my Starbucks order is and you guys can trust me when I say it's delicious. A grande iced shaken espresso with five pumps of brown sugar syrup. You sub the original syrup that's inside. And sweet cream cold foam. It's the perfect mix of a very strong, like tasting espresso and a sweet, like creaminess to it. It is so good. If you're like a coffee lover and you enjoy the taste of like espresso, not like caramel macchiato bullshit, kidding. They're still good. But I just mean if you really enjoy coffee, you're gonna love it. Tag me if you guys try it. It's lunch time, lunch time, lunch time. Yeah. Damn, I feel that. Oh, okay, grocery haul. Just did some groceries because we didn't exactly have everything that I needed for the ideas that I wanted to cook today. Lunch is gonna be chicken quesadilla. I got some fresh bread, tostitos, beef broth, tomato sauce. I bought ready-made chicken because lunch is all about being easy, simple, right? And quick. If I'm having a busy day, we gotta go, gotta go. So we eat something quick for lunch. Dinner is more extravagant. Dark red, kidney beans, red pepper, and some shredded cheese. Okay. Excuse me while I eat a piece of salami. So the chicken quesadillas are pretty simple. Only tortilla that I had at home was spinach tortilla, which is totally fine. So all you're gonna do is add a little bit of butter to your pan, make sure it doesn't burn. Warm up your tortilla, add your chicken slices, add some cheese to cover it all up. And then I just season with whatever feels right. When it comes to cooking for me, I think I'm a very much a eyeballer. Me too. Yeah, I just kind of go with what feels right. And it usually doesn't fail me. Trial and error, baby. Mm -hmm. Not the boot like pizza. Saw the, the recipe on TikTok. It looked good, so I'm gonna try it. Really? With yeah. white bread? Yeah. Interesting. So with my beverage of choice, guess in the comments what's my favorite drink. One, two, three. I see it! Correct. Unfortunately, we only have juice boxes, like little babies, but it's still I see. So. Uh, they don't taste good when they're not cold. Aww. Oh. All right, my quesadilla is ready to be eaten. I could cut it, but I won't. Oh, okay. The tortilla is a little crispy. I could have left it on for not as long. This would taste really good with hot sauce. We don't have any. Uh, yeah, sriracha. Not sriracha. What's the weirdest food combo you've ever had? Nutella and vanilla yogurt. Huh, that is pretty Goldfish weird. Goldfish and avocado cheese. 
Um, have you ever had chips, like potato chips with Greek yogurt? Uh, no. It's not that bad, but that's not something that I eat normally. That's lunch. Um, I'll let you know if I eat any snacks, but it's low-key already 4 p.m. So I probably won't, because I'm gonna make dinner around like 7. I'm gonna make chili, but I need to do a little prep right now, which I should have done a while ago. I feel like this is gonna take forever. Just FYI for everybody wondering, I still live at home, so I do have at-home privileges where I don't cook my dinner. Majority of the time, my parents do. I do cook my breakfast, lunch, and then like once or twice a week, I will just cook dinner for everybody. So that's what I'm doing today. Let it simmer on like a low heat, just so it gets a bit thicker. And then we can eat. Chili's ready. Sorry for the bad lighting, so bad. Okay, so you can eat with a little bit of bread or some tostitos. Here's the chili. You have to add some cheese. Did you add cheese? So how do you like it? It's good. What do we do? <laughs> you can put some cheese on it. Mmm. Very good. It has like a homey taste to it. Chili? Yeah. What is this? Chili. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen. Oh shit. I look rough. I haven't looked in the mirror in a couple hours. Um, just wanna share with you guys that I'm having a little late night snacky snack. And I'm not gonna lie, I'm such a snacker and I'm surprised I didn't today apart from this. But I think it's because I was busy in between breakfast and lunch, and then I ate lunch so late that I didn't need to snack until dinner. Maybe that's the key to not snacking, I don't know. I have some Christmas chocolate for Roche, my favorite chocolate in the world. If you guys want to send it to me, my address is These are just some Christmas chocolates that um, I found. They're literally like crispy chocolate chips, like literally in the shape of chips. And last but not least, I religiously drink chamomile tea at night before I go to bed because I don't know about you guys, I can never fall asleep. We can have a whole nother video dedicated to my sleep schedule, I swear to God, it's atrocious. That caps off what I'm gonna be eating for the whole entire day. I hope you guys like this little perspective. I don't know, like midway through filming this, I'm like, what the fuck is this video? Like, do people really want to know what Alex Adams is eating in a random day of her life? You guys tell me. This is the first time I did one of these and I've seen them around YouTube for a long ass time. Like people have been making these videos and I'm like, okay, let me give it a shot. Switch the content up a little bit. But yeah, give me ideas on videos that you like that you have not seen me make before. Um, I'll have like the chili recipe in the description. I don't know if anyone's gonna want that. It looked a little unappetizing. It was actually very delicious. Everything else is pretty self-explanatory of what I made during the day. I'm not one of these bougie, healthy, freaky girls. Um, wish I was. And I don't think I ate a single vegetable today, but I did eat a fruit. Damn, my diet's gonna walk. Yeah, don't take any meal inspiration from me. Just take a good time away from this. Okay, hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe. A huge amount of you guys are not subscribed and watch my videos and don't hit the button, but it means a lot to me. So subscribe, like this video, and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.